Get out here. Jeez, you two just never learn. Yan Xing. Careful, Shenhua. <clears throat> I'm gonna beat your friends to a bloody pulp now. Hope you enjoy the front row seat. Keep your distance, Shenhua. Okay. Who put you up to this? I don't know anything. Who put you up to this? I don't know anything. Take care of him. Got it. Hey. You little pipsqueak! Don't think for one second you're better than me just because you beat me! All you did was get lucky! What did you say to me? Well, looky here! On another date with your cute little girlfriend! Don't you two make a cute couple! <laughs> Leo, don't listen to him. He's just trying to goad you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I have a question for you. Huh? 
Why the hell should I answer a little punk like you? Give it up. You have nowhere to run. <sighs> now, answer me. Who sent you? Who's your boss? Boss? No one's the boss of me. You're not going to tell me, are you? What? You think I'm just going to cough it up? You're even dumber than you look, kid. Enough. If you don't tell me, I'll beat it out of you. Is that what you want? <laughs> are you threatening me? You don't have the stones, kid. I swear, I'll do it. Hey, Ryo. Shenhua. No, Ryo. Just don't. Yeah, but... We'd be no different. Uh, you're right, Shenhua. <laughs> so, what do we do then? Who are you? Who, me? Can't you tell by looking? What? I'm just your friendly neighborhood thug. Yeah. Stop kidding around. I'm asking where you came from. Who the hell are you? You little brat! Who do you think you're talking to? Why don't you learn some manners first? What? If you want me to answer, say pretty please. Why, you? He's not going to answer us willingly. Damn it. <laughs> hey, do you know Mr. Yun? Yun? Who the hell's that? Mr. Yun, the stonemason. That is my father. Nope. Don't know, don't care. You guys dropped it, didn't you? He dropped it? Ugh, that idiot. Wait, what? Oh, uh, nothing. Huh? You people went after all the stonemasons on this list, didn't you? Spit it out. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know nothing about no stonemasons or that piece of paper. Are you sure? Look, I don't know what I don't know. What's your plan? What do you want? Why did you target this village? Why? Oh, I don't know. What do you think? I'm the one asking the questions. Now answer me, damn you! Oh, look at you acting like you're all grown up. You're not even a man yet, boy. What? Leo, don't let him get to you. I know, damn it. <laughs> it looks like your little girlfriend has more brains and wit than you. Guess we know who wears the pants, huh? You piece of... Leo. Could you all wait outside? You too, Leo. Are you sure? I'll just be a minute. Trust me. Okay. He's all yours. Hey. Huh? You think I'm afraid of a little girl like you? Huh? What? Huh? <clears throat> Shenhua? Shenhua, I'm coming in. Uh, uh, Shenhua, what did you... He says he'll tell us everything. <laughs> That's good. Well then, let's hear it. Talk. I said talk. Who are you? My name's Yin Lang. I'm just a common thug. Well, maybe not common, but you get my drift. I still can't believe I caved into this girl. 
You were easy. I've had a harder time breaking chopsticks. You win. Do what you want with me. Have at it! You turned around quick. What's up with this girl anyway? She's absolutely brutal! Speaking of, what exactly did you do to this guy, Shenhua? Oh, you want to know? I can give a demonstration. No, no more! Please! Pretty please, even! Shenhua. Why did you come to Bai Lu? You want to go for round two? No, no, ma'am. Then talk. At first, we were ordered to search for a mirror made out of some kind of special stone. I forgot what it was called. But we couldn't find the damn thing no matter where we looked. Is that why you targeted the stonemasons? I've been... I don't hear an answer. Ring the bell, yo. Okay, okay, I'll talk. Go on. When we reported back about the mirror, our next order was to kidnap its stonemason. I knew it. So you took my father? You kidnapped Mr. Yuan? Yuan. Yuan. Yeah, sounds familiar. He, he was the only one that could carve that whatchamacallit rock. Phantom Riverstone. Where did you take my father? Where is he now? We handed him off to the other guys. Where did they take him? I don't know. I swear. The thing is, our gang has several hideouts in a town along the Lijiang River. But I don't know where they all are. Oh, no. This can't be happening. You better not have laid a finger on him. No, no. He's fine. I swear. They said to hand him over in one piece. No injuries, no scratches. Father... Who ordered you? Was it that creepy-looking guy with the hunchback? No, not him. Our orders came from higher-up. So who are the higher-ups? I don't know. What? What do you mean you don't know? No, really! I honestly don't know! You think I'm going to fall for that? Ding, ding. So you do want some more? No! I'm telling you the truth! I swear on my life! When we talked to them, we weren't even allowed to see their faces. What? And if we didn't comply, they would have killed us on the spot. That skinhead guy's just a watchdog. He was there to keep an eye on us. Is he Chi Yu Men? Hard to say. It's not like we could just ask him. We just kept our mouths shut and followed orders. You know, search for the mirror and its stonemason. What did you tell him? Not much. I just gave him intel on the bridge. Wait, the Verdant Bridge? Why would you... What's so special about the Verdant Bridge? What do you know about it? Tell us! Beats me! Never cared in the first place! In fact, why do I care now? There's no turning back for me anyway! <laughs> Come to think of it, nothing matters anymore! <laughs> you piece of... Take it easy. If you want to know that bad, go talk to the old hag. Old hag? You mean elder, yeah? Uh, sounds about right. If you care about her, then you better get going. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? You know that chai guy? He should be at that old lady's place right about now. If I were you, I'd leave now. I'm telling you, Chai is one sick puppy. He'll go to any lengths to get what he wants. Even to a sweet little old lady. <laughs> Damn it! Leo, we have to go to Elder Ye's house right now. We got all we need to know. We have to hurry to Elder Ye's. Yeah, you're right. Let's go. Mr. Wong, Mr. Liu, we're done with him. You can let him go now. What? You're not seriously thinking about letting him go, are you? The longer he stays in the village, the more trouble he will cause. And there's no guarantee that his friends won't come for him. Oh yeah, that's true. Anyway, let's hurry.